Someone is doing this to you. You feel this thing all the time. This thing, you feel it like someone is doing this. In Jesus' name. Jesus' name. Thank you for Jesus' name. They are right. What is There are many people who ask me this. Ask me, you say, who may I say you? Oh, okay, give me three. This is the way you feel you can say. I am not in shoes. Um, I know how to be. And um, whatever you put me to, I'll do it. Can I hear this way? Say it again. I know music. Yeah. I'm, uh, I'm a leader in my church, but I'm no music leader. Um, I know how to lead, and whatever you ask of me, I will do. Can I hear that? So, are you, are you here tomorrow? I will be here, no matter what it is. So, yeah. <laughs> well, can you hear? There are many people like this one who, who will be brought to me because of the assignment. This man, where do you live? In South Carolina. South Carolina. Think about it. So tomorrow you are here? I will be here. What time is the sales tomorrow? 12 o'clock. 12 o'clock here? Yeah. Okay. Let me see you tomorrow. God bless you. Thanks. Greetings in the name of Jesus. Could you tell us your name and where you come from and your encounter today? Uh, greetings in the name of Jesus. Um, my name is Isaiah Sidalgo. I come from South Carolina. Um, today's encounter was something different. Um, we thank God for everything that he does. Um, today, um, when the man of God anointed me, um, he said that he's going to give me something that I can never forget. And then he started um, rubbing my face. And right now my face feels like it's on fire, like somebody's rubbing it. And it feels like it's on fire. I can't, can't even describe what I feel right now. Also, I had a dream. I had a dream in the morning. Well, I think it was, I believe it was Monday morning. And... I slept, and then around like 3 a.m. I had a dream, which was, I had a little to give because of my economical circumstances that allowed me to come to this place. And I was grouped with the Apostle and Andrews, and there's many people there, and they were needing funds. And after the little that I had, I gave everything. And then I woke up, I prayed about it, I slept again, and then I had another dream that it was kind of like, Apostle came to me with like a, like papers and he said, I read your report and he said, you have something about the job. So he gave me a paper and he said, read it because I didn't believe him. Then he came to my, my truck and he was leaving and then because of my circumstances, I said, you know what, I'd rather just serve. So how may I help you? 
And then he started laughing and he said, come. And he introduced me to like this guy. And then I was kind of like working with him. And that was the dream. And that's what led me here. Yeah. And well, God allowed me to come here and we're able to serve with music. Um, they're gonna give me the privilege to play an instrument. So we pray how that goes. Amen.